Different types of wood for furniture, both hardwood and softwood, are available in the market. Each type comes with a different set of characteristics in terms of color, density, grain, and finishing. Picking the right wood for furniture is critical as it helps you to determine the exact price of your unit. It will also be a deciding factor when you want to restore, resale, or discard a piece of furniture. Although you can use any type of wood to make furniture, not all woods are made equal. That's why you need to choose it carefully. When it comes to choosing the best wood for your furniture, understanding its properties is a must. While you watch our today's collection, we will tell you detailed information on the various aspects of wood. Hello there, welcome to our channel. Today we will show you another collection of wood furniture and wood decorative pieces ideas for your interior design and home decor. So, watch the video until the end to see these beautiful ideas and get inspiration. We post wood made furniture, decor and craft ideas videos on daily basis. So, if you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing to never miss these inspirational furniture, decor and craft ideas. Smash the notification bell so that you will be notified when we upload new videos. Also don't forget to like and share this video as your likes and shares enable us grow our channel and give you more content in return. Hardness is one of the simplest ways to distinguish the wood used for furniture. Contrary to the popular belief, hardwood is not necessarily harder and denser compared to softwood. In botanical terms, hardwood comes from flowering trees while softwood comes from conifers. Both hardwood and softwood are used for everything from structural to decorative purposes. Hardwood comes from angiosperms such as maple, oak, and walnut. These trees lose their leaves annually in other words they are deciduous or broad leaf trees. As they grow slowly, hardwood has denser wood fibers. An interesting fact about hardwood is that some types of hardwood can't float in water. For example, Black ironwood is perhaps the hardest and heaviest wood that sinks in water. When we look at the properties of hardwood include the fact that it grows slowly compared to softwoods. So, hardwood is relatively expensive. However, there are exceptions such as gum which is a hardwood that comes at a price comparable with most types of softwood. Hardwood is durable. It is less likely to decay and rot and it comes with close grain, and requires low maintenance. As it comes with slow sap content and good fire resistance, hardwood is commonly used for wooden flooring. However, hardwood flooring also revered for its varied natural colors, styles and perforation plate patterns. It is also used for making furniture. However, all types of hardwood are not ideal for making furniture. Softwood comes from gymnosperms, which are seed-bearing evergreen trees such as pine, spruce, fir, cedar, juniper, redwood, and yew. As most evergreen trees tend to be less dense than deciduous trees, it is easier to cut them down. They also grow tall and straight, making it easier to cut long straight planks of wood. When we look at the properties of softwood, usually softwood consists of tracheids and wood rays but lacks vessels. As vessels are absent, softwood is also called non-porous wood. The lack of vessels allows softwoods to absorb adhesives quickly, resulting in a better finish.
Softwood is commonly used in building materials such as structural frames, exterior and interior wall cladding, fittings, floor coverings, formwork, and scaffolding, among others. It is also used in the paper and cardboard industry. Softwood comes with loose grain, higher sap content, and lighter color. However, it has poor fire resistance. Its fine and lightweight structure makes it the best wood for furniture. We will talk about the specific characteristics of the different types of softwoods and hardwoods in another video. Well, there you have them. Our hand-picked wood furniture and wood decorative pieces ideas for your interior design and home decor. Which ones did you like? What did you like about them? Share us your thoughts in the comment section. We hope you've enjoyed our today's content. If you do, please consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't already and also smash that notification bell so that you will be the first one to be notified when we upload new videos. It takes a lot of time and effort to make these videos. Your subscriptions, likes and shares are what inspire us to create more content. Therefore please consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't already. And finally, thank you for watching until the end. We look forward to seeing you in our next video. Until then, stay safe and stay blessed.